favorite brand of this year is the next favorite Korean beauty brand is how can I wrap up this year without wank, wank. everyone's been doing it this year and it's likely to continue in 2024 hello annyeong this is Yuhi from One Eye Beauty the place to find all the Korean beauty info in One Eye how is your end of the year going everyone busy busy having lots of fun as we wrap up this year I thought I must share with you all my own best Korean beauty brands of 2023 that served me really well throughout this year in December I'll be doing a series of best Korean beauty brands videos that were popular in Korea and the brands that were popular in the West so make sure you subscribe to not to miss out on any of my best series videos and many great videos to come in the new year thank you so much Kamsamida. so without further ado shall we get this going yeah before we start this video I should let you know my skin type my skin type is dry and sensitive, so ideally I need products that are gentle on my skin yet effective enough to remove my makeup at the end of the day. And I go through problems with hyperpigmentation, uneven skin tone, and a bit of redness during hot summer and very cold winter times. Not so acne prone, however, there was a phase in my life around mid 20s when I went through major trouble with acne, like that came all at once. So I do understand the pain of it. In this video, I'll be sharing with you the best Korean beauty brands that worked really well on my current dry skin and their best sellers in the oily and acne prone skin type category. My first favorite brand of this year is Isn't Tree. This brand is almost like a representative Korean skincare brand for clean beauty, in my opinion. With their belief of island plus nature plus tree, their skincare motto is a healthy, beauty's reliable, safe and natural ingredients. They don't do any, any more testing. It's a clean skincare brand with sustainable packaging as well, which is a trend that will lead on in 2024. As you can see, their brand identity, the leaf packaging here, you can remove this easily after usage. So it's a sustainable packaging which you can recycle easily so I think this brand will do really well in the new year as well and all of their products I liked from this brand are over here and first one I liked was hydronic acid toner plus this is a three-in-one toner that works as a toner plus essence plus ampule the key ingredient is the five types of hydronic acid it is the deeply hydrating toner it worked absolutely brilliantly on my dry skin the other part I really liked was the Hyaluronic Acid Water Sun Gel. This is a light well chemical sunscreen, extremely moisturizing with eight types of hyaluronic acid, skin soothing with Centella Asiatica as well. I also really enjoyed their Yamru skincare line. I have done a video about this line previously. With the one I really enjoyed the, was the Vegan Milk Cleanser. This is a gentle cleanser enriched with yam root extract, which is rich in phytomucin. Phytomucin is an ingredient that protects the skin barrier from external aggressors, and it keeps the skin smooth and moisturizing, and it also contains amino acid, which helps to soothe the skin. This milk cream cleanser emulsifies almost immediately after rub onto your hands. First, I thought, is this working? Is this really a cleanser? But after a while, you get used to it, and it's so gentle and soothing on your face. I absolutely loved it. It has been my absolute favorite morning cleanser. The reason I use it in the morning was because it has a low pH level of 5.5. I thought it would be too gentle to remove any makeup but it's strong enough to remove all the residues and sebums that gets built up in the morning. So it has been my absolute favorite morning cleanser. This one and I also really like the Yam Root Vegan Milk Cream. This contains 57% of the Yam Root extract, which is also has phytomucin, and it has five types of ceramides, highly effective ingredient for skin moisture and strengthening skin barrier. This cream might not be enough for the dry skin types in winter time, but for oily and combo skin types, this will be a very nice moisturizing enough gentle cream. Some of other bestsellers from Isentry include Hyaluronic Acid Aqua Gel Cream. This has won in the Vana Media Awards. And one of my subscribers mentioned that she loved it. It's a deeply moisturizing gel type of cream with five kinds of concentrated hyaluronic acid. And the Hyaluronic Acid Airy Sunstick has been a big hit as well. This has won in the Vana Media category. 
It's a matte sunstick with hyaluronic acid. And the green tea fresh toner has been very popular amongst the oily skin types especially. It's a hydrating toner with 80% of green tea from Jeju. And the chestnut BHA 2% clear liquid. This has been very popular amongst the oily skin types. Sue from Sue Beauty who has combination skin types. Whenever she has trouble with the skin, she seems to clear it all up with this. So she raved about it a lot. This is an exfoliating toner that's infused with BHA which helps to tighten the pores and helps to improve breakouts. Anything that includes BHA or AHA, AHA doesn't suit to my skin. I, I, my skin can't take it but this has been very popular amongst the oily and combo skin types. My husband really enjoyed this as well. I got my friends to try it with the oily skin types. They all said this is a uh, very nice toner. And one of their newly released products, Anya New Pear Sunscreen, developed with Cassandra Benson, seem to be doing really well already. This is a creamy chemical sunscreen with SPS 40 and PA3 pluses, which is a high enough strength to be used during autumn and winter time. This contains 5% of red onion extract, multi vita complex, and heart leaf extract, which is a hydrating and soothing ingredient on the skin. Its purple color will help to even up the skin tone at the same time. My next favorite K Beauty skincare brand is Corsorex. This is a hero K-beauty brand to treat the sensitive and troubled skin. One of the most successful Korean beauty brands as well in the global market. I really enjoy their snail line and the ones I enjoyed the most were Advanced Snail 96 Mousin Power Essence. A viral essence with 96% of snail secretion filtrate. Very hydrating, reduces redness, improves wrinkles. It's a true multifunctional essence. I also really like the Advanced Snail Dual Essence. This is very nourishing. I actually like this more than this 96 Snail Power Essence. This is enriched with 74.3% of Triple Snail Complex and it has niacinamide as well. I found this much more nourishing, so I prefer this to the other one. Along with these, I also really like the Advanced Snail Hydrogel Eye Patch. I no longer have this one with me, but I did feature this in my previous Hydrogel comparison video as well as in my recent empties video as well. It's a hydrogel eye patch with 20,400 ppm or snail secretion filtrate. It strengthens skin's elasticity, helps with improving the wrinkles around the eye area. If you've never tried a hydrogel eye patch and would like to try one but not sure which to choose, I'd say go for this one unless you react to snail filtrate. The patch size is quite large in comparison to other eye patches from other brands. Its thickness is perfect. It sticks to your skin really nice and pleasantly and it consists of three patches instead of two like other eye patches from other brands which is very flexible which you can stick on to. I usually do it between my eyebrows but you can stick it anywhere else like on your forehead and other parts. It's very flexible and it gives great results as well. And all of the Corsorex's Propolis line is amazing. The products I enjoyed the most were Propolis Synergy Toner. I have featured this product in my best of 2023 video. This is a very nourishing and hydrating toner. They all work well for dry as well as oily skin types because oily skin types need lots of hydration too. Otherwise your sebum will be produced even more. So it's great for any skin types. And Propolis is also great for treating acne. So there we go, good for any skin types. I also like the Propolis Ampule. This is deeply nourishing. It's almost like a serum version of this toner, which is already nourishing, but this is deeply nourishing. And their other bestsellers include Acne Pimple Master Patch. This is apparently a holy grail product for acne treatment. It's a hydrocolloid type of patch that helps to focus on treating partial skin troubles. There are skincare experts out there who do not recommend pimple patches as it will just completely block air coming in and out from your troubled area. And I personally don't think that's a good idea as well. But apparently if you apply after extraction, you should be okay. But before will be a definite no-no. After, 
I think it'll be good to actually to protect it from the germs as well. Another product that is very popular amongst the oily skin types especially is this one over here, the classic course rigged product, low pH good morning gel cleanser. This contains tea tree oil and natural BHA to refine skin texture and help with skin breakouts. And they also have some popular functional skincare products like retinol serum and niacinamide 15 serum which I have got over here. This consists of niacinamide 15%. I've tried up to 10% but never up to 15% so this is yet to be tried so I'll let you know how I go with this one in the new year. Next best skincare brand is One Thing. This brand is a Korean version of The Ordinary in my opinion, committed with the philosophy less is more, concentrate on one ingredient in each of their products. What I really liked is this one over here, One Thing Niacinamide 10%. This has been featured a number of times in my previous videos because it's such a versatile product. This is a hypoallergic toner with 10% niacinamide. I usually use this with my retinol serum as retinol serum on its own is too harsh on my sensitive skin. If I use it along with niacinamide 10% toner, which is very watery, it actually makes my retinol serum to like turn into a perfect texture, which is quite thick on its own. It mix it up together, it makes it less harsh on my skin and texture goes perfect as well. And during winter time, I can use it as like toner pack as well, using my toner pad and you can mix it up with your cream that doesn't have niacinamide. It's such a versatile product and it lasts for so long as it's 150 ml. Another very versatile product from one thing I liked was One Thing Jojoba Golden Organic Oil. This I featured a number of times in my previous videos as well, including my blackhead removal video because jojoba oil is very effective ingredient to remove blackheads and whiteheads. This feels very nourishing on its own and it also can be mixed with your moisturizers in winter time to make it extra soothing on the skin. Another very versatile product from One Thing. Some of other best-selling products from One Thing includes Centella Asiatica Extract, which is formulated with 100% Korean Centella Asiatica Extract that helps with anti-inflammatory, soothes irritated skin, and improves skin elasticity. And another best-selling product includes this one over here, which I'm hoping I'll pronounce it correctly, but let's see how I do this. Hoatunia Kodata Extract. Hoatunia Kodata Extract is developed to reduce acne and blackheads. And they have this another very innovative product which I really love to try is this one over here, Pure Cotton Facial Mask. This product is like a DIY your own mask. So based on your skin concern, you can mix it up with your favorite toner and make your own perfect mask. Next favorite Korean skincare brand is this one over here, Numbersen. Numbers in what's your number? So they do their skincare line by numbers. You choose the number of the skincare products which goes with your skincare concern. The products I liked are all over here. First, the Clear Filter Sun Essence. I have featured this so many times now. I raved about it in my best of sunscreen video and best product of 2023 video. This is a very moisturizing sun essence with 10 hour sun protection. I also really enjoy the number no. 5 plus vitamin concentrated serum. This is an intensive dark spot care serum with glutathione, vitamin, niacinamide and trisomic acid. It's a total blemish care serum. I also really enjoy the number no. 5 plus vitamin niacinamide concentrated pad. This is a brightening care toner pad which I've picked in my best of 2023 video as well. This is basically this number no. 5 plus toner turned into a toner pad. If you use this along with this serum over here, it doubles the brightening effect. If you want to find out more about this toner pad, I suggest you go and check out my previous video as I can go on and on and on and on about this toner pad is it's such a great toner pad with a perfect thickness, and great texture, which is also dual-sided, gives a great brightening result. I also really enjoy their number one pure fuel calming herb toner, which are also picked in their best of 2023 videos in the toner category. I picked two and one of them was this one. This is a skin calming toner with 93% of concentrated herbal extracts. 
I also really enjoyed one of their best-selling toners over here, number three, Super Glowing Essence Toner. This contains 50 types of fermented ingredients to give you that glowing and radiant skin. This has been my favorite toner that does really give you that glowing skin. Some people did mention that they don't like the smell of this toner. It does have a bit of a strong botanical smell, which I didn't mind at all. And some of their other best products include number three, Skin Softening Serum. It is enriched with 42% of Bifida and Galactomyces to moisturize and enhance skin elasticity. Another best selling include this one over here, number six, Deep Sleep Mask Serum. This is a serum-like textured overnight mask with a deeply hydrating ingredient. 60% of glacial water, hyaluron acid, and niacinamide. Next best KBT brand is Toradin. This is a very popular brand in Korea, each line deeply concentrated on one ingredient. The best selling line is Hyaluronic Acid line and some of the products from the Hyaluronic Acid line I really enjoyed were Dive In Low Molecular Hydrating Acid Cleansing Foam. This is an award winning cleansing foam with eight types of hyaluronic acid. I've also picked this in my best of 2023 video my main reason was because it's very moisturizing on the skin, plus it has a pH level of around between 6 to 7, which still falls into the acidic line, but in high acidic. So it's gentle, yet effectively removes the, all the heavy makeup and sebum on your face at the same time. So a highly effective cleansing foam that does the job really well. Another product from the Hyaluron Acid line I really enjoyed was their Dive in low molecular hydro acid toner. This is another award winning toner with five types of hyaluronic acid. Another hyaluronic acid line product I really enjoyed was their Dive in low molecular hyaluronic acid soothing cream. I featured this in my empties video. This contains five types of hyaluronic acid. It's a very soothing and moisturizing gel type of cream, which was very ideal to use during summertime. Some of the other best-selling products from Toradin includes pretty much the entire hyaluronic acid line. The serum is very popular and the mineral sunscreen has been doing very well this year as well. And they have other lines such as the yellow ceramide line which helps to reduce the redness. Also the green seeker line which helps for soothing the skin has been doing well as well. Generally the Centella Asiatica, this has been the ingredient of this year in my opinion. It has been everywhere. Everyone's been doing it this year and it's likely to continue in 2024. Moving on to the next favorite Korean beauty brand is Dr. Suruko. This is a K-beauty brand with a principal theory of botanic science focusing on research-based formula. And their product, Vegan Kombucha Tea Essence, this has been loved by so many skin influencers this year, including Kelly Driscoll. This is a very Instagrammable product. As you shake it, it turns into like a different color. As the fermented formula gets mixed up and turns into like a creamy, color like this. This is a small version of 50ml but using the 150ml bottle you can see this even better. This is concentrated with 78% of vegan tea complex which is rich in probiotics which is a highly effective antioxidant ingredient. So it'll help to detoxify and strengthen your skin barrier and it'll also help to balance your oil and moisture level. So it'll be perfect for oily skin types and also for dry skin types as it's very hydrating as well. Along with the essence, I also really enjoyed their vegan kombucha tea gel cream. This is also concentrated with 78% vegan tea complex. It's a gel type of cream that is deeply soothing on the skin and it smells divine. I also really enjoy their sun care product, this one over here, Hyo Reuse Moist Sun SPF 50 Plus PA 4 Pluses. This is an extremely moisturizing sun care product that has a serum-like texture with 10 types of hyaluronic acid, panthenol, and niacinamide. I really like this sunscreen with this hydrating texture, but the reason I didn't add this into my top five sun screen video is because it has a particular SPS smell which is quite strong. So if it wasn't for that reason, this would have definitely been added in my top five sunscreen video. But I still really enjoyed it. It's a real one-of-a-kind serum-like sunscreen. Some of the other best-selling Dr. Circle products include their 
vegan active berry line. Products in this line contain active berry complex to boost moisture and skin vitality. And they also have a tea tree line. Tea tree is a highly effective ingredient for anti-inflammation that soothes blemish prone skin. So it's very much loved by the acne prone skin types. And the last but not least, my favorite Korean skincare brand of 2023 is Beauty of Joseon. How can I wrap up this year without Beauty of Joseon? Along with their brand philosophy, a modern Hanbang skincare brand, this brand has been a huge success throughout this year, especially in the global market. In my One Eye Beauty blog, you can find two articles featuring top five products from Beauty of Joseon for dry skin and oily skin types. So do go and check them out if you're interested. My favorite products from Beauty of Joseon include the Glow Serum. This serum contains 60% of propolis and 2% of niacinamide. It is the most thick serum out of the four serums. It controls blemishes and boost skin moisture so it's good for oily skin type as well as dry skin types and i have to mention this product over here i lost its lid so it won't stand unfortunately the revive eye serum with ginseng and retinol this has been featured in my best of 2023 video this is one of the most viral product from beauty of joseon for a good reason it gives a really good result another beauty of joseon product which i've been raving a lot is this one over here the dynasty cream this is an elegant cream with ginseng root extract niacinamide rice bran mortar and squalene this is great for skin moisture skin brightening pore tightening and anti-aging and of course, I really enjoy their ginseng cleansing oil. I haven't got this product with me as I finished it, but I have done a whole video of this cleansing oil comparing it along with other best-selling Western brand cleansing oils and Japanese cleansing oils. And it was my very first video when I opened up this channel. So it is very meaningful to me and it performed really well as well. This ginseng cleansing oil contains 50% of soybean oil and 0.1% of ginseng seed oil. I am going to be repurchasing this because I really miss it. I like its subtle ginseng smell and how it's really soothing on my skin. And of course, there are other best-selling products and the product I also really enjoyed is this one over here, the Relief Sun Probiotics and Rice Sunscreen. This was the ultimate best-selling product, a really lightweight chemical sunscreen that gives you a glowing finish without any white cast. And some of their other best-selling products include their red bean line, which is very popular amongst the oily skin types. Their red bean pore mask with 30% of red bean extract help with minimizing the appearance of pores is also very much loved by Felicia from Beauty Within. And one of their newly released products, Light On Centella Vita C Serum. This contains 68% of Centella Asiatica, told you this is like the ingredient of this year, seem to be receiving a lot of great reputations. If you're interested in shopping for any of the products I've mentioned in today's video, all the shopping links will be down at the information section below, so go and check them out. And which brands were your favorite brands? Please tell me by leaving a comment down at the information section below. I'd love to hear from you all. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next Korean beauty video. Annyeong! Thank you.